we are back with Glenn Velvet Reviews today. And so I got the um, overflow hanging on the back there. I never had one of these. I have no idea how to use it. I tried to watch some videos. They're like 12 years old. I mean, I don't know how the algorithms work on YouTube where, you know, when you search for stuff, you know, because I don't know. I mean, I, I don't own YouTube, so I have no idea how they do it. But um, anyway, the, the videos that just kept popping up were like 12 years old, 10 years old. So anyway, um, and they were all really the same. Everything was, you know, used the tubing. So I'm just going to use airline tubing for now. I'm thinking about um, getting another YouTube um uh, you know, one of these tubes over here. I'm going to get another one of those. I'm going to figure out a way to drill into the top and make something that um, I can, you know, s get the water uh, out, uh, well, get the air out easily this way. It'll, you know, start the siphon. I mean, I talked to e-shops um, and I talked to just a couple other people on, you know, the internet and um, they said that, um, they said they've had their e-shops running for like three to five years so far. So one was three years, one was five years. And they said it has never broken siphon, you know, by itself unless they did it while they were, you know, changing out the, um, uh, well, unless they were doing maintenance or they, uh, and they were doing it themselves, like, and they intentionally did it. Uh, they said it has never happened, um, you know, with a power outage or something getting clogged in there. So, and I kind of believe them, um, you know what I mean? Because if you have a good filtration s system, that shouldn't get clogged anyway. And if you're using good water, it shouldn't get clogged. You know what I mean? So that's pretty much uh, what's up. So this is my first time like ever doing one of these or seeing what's up. So I'm not even sure what's gonna happen here. So all I know is um, we gotta, oh shit, let me break in here. So all I know is we gotta turn uh, this pump on, right? And I'll show you my, my setup after I completely do, uh, you know, the whole thing, the whole yada yada. Um, but uh, let's see what's up here. I'm going to try to get on top so you guys can see kind of what's going on. Because, I, like I said, I never turn one of these on. I just filled it right up to the rim. I put the step stool over there so we can kind of see, um, you know, what's going on here. Because, you know, I'm short. So I'm going to turn on the pump. We're going to get some water in there and see what it looks like together. Ready? All right, so I guess it's filling up in there, right? Okay, so that's all I'm gonna do right now. Let me see what it looks like. All right, so I am pretty much all the way up. Uh, so from what I saw, there needs to be water on both sides. So I guess let's uh, wing this and hope for the best. All right, so I filled up both sides um, I'm sorry you can't see like you know everything over here but uh, anyway so I, pu I put my tube and I stuck it uh, man, and I stuck it pretty deep I stuck it like in the back here this way I could start sucking the air and then when I notice I can pull it because if I go from here and there's still a bubble here it's gonna be way too hard to fish this back into there right correct are you with me yes good so I'm gonna take this one out because there's no point of having the both in when I can't even do the both of them anyway at the moment um, so we're gonna suck this out. I just taped it right here to make it easy for myself. So let's see, ready? All right, let's give it a plug. Give it a plug. Oh man, I think it's going. That pump is loud as hell. I wonder why that guy was probably selling it. What a ass. Doesn't that sound loud as hell? The pump sounds so loud. Oh wow, look, my shit's overflowing. I think because uh maybe I'm overdoing it. Oh, let me pull uh oh. Uh-oh. Let's see here. I guess I got All right, it's draining. See if it can keep up. 
So with one pipe, with that 550 gallons, it was too much. Because you saw, guys, it was overflowing in here. Oh wow, it's still overflowing. Isn't that crazy? How is that not enough? Very crazy. I only have one pump. So, what I'm guessing is, I need to take something out of that bag. Because that is not happening. No, it's not even that. This is in keeping up. Huh. It says this is rated for 1,200 gallons per minute. All right, well, you saw, I have a small pump. It was kind of overflowing. Uh, you know what I mean? I was like, wow. So I'm going to test this thing out, obviously. I'm going to take, um, you know, these out. Maybe with these out, it's uh, 1,200. Um, maybe. I don't know. Because I wasn't getting 1,200 with these on it. As you saw, it was um, overflowing. And uh, it was it was filling up past that as we all saw so the tubes themselves weren't keeping up with the only like i said 550 gallon per hour i have at my spout so i don't know all right anyway that was a test um like i said i um just am a little confused but uh, maybe i need to mess with it and look into it um maybe i'll even call the e-shops up and find out what's going on because um obviously you could see it was the water with the pump was going past what's going on down here obviously you could see with the pump the this was going past this so it was the problem with these tubes these tubes were not bringing the water fast enough for that pump and you would, i thought with two tubes it would have been okay but you saw with the one tube it was bad but then when i tried it with two tubes it still was overflowing so you know what i mean i'm all i don't know i'm all confused or you know whatever the case may be um, yeah, so I'm all confused. I don't know what's going on, whatever. Uh, so I, like I said, I'm either going to call e-shops or I'm going to do some research online. Because like I said, it says 1200 and that wasn't really flowing. Um, and as you could see, the problem was the U, uh, tubes weren't going, um, fast enough. Um, and it wasn't anything else other than that. So, all right. All right. So, uh, that's it for Glenn Velvet Reviews on an update on that. I'll be setting up the tank and all the rest of it. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. Also, subscribe to my channel. Join me on my review adventures as I try to put up stuff to help out the community, just like I get help from the community. All right, everybody enjoy. Be safe. I'm out. Bye-bye.